Hello everyone, it's Sheila back again. Um, I've been doing a little bit um, shopping. I've been to the um, the range in Poundland. Um, I was looking for some um, wool for it's a couple of orders. Um, one one white cardigan. So I've got this this wool here for, and um, possibly a, um, a blue one. Um, so I went went to have a look to see. I could get the um, the white, but um, I couldn't get enough of the. Um, the blue that I, um, I wanted but um, as I don't have to do with the blue one uh, straight away I don't have to do with the white one straight away um, anyway because I'm doing um, another one actually I'm doing this one I've just started this 53 inch for a, um, a gentleman wants it for his mother's um, birthday and I've just started doing this one so that's going to be a couple of weeks to win this one so I'll not be able to start the white one until I finish this one and then um, the blue one will be after that, so I've got uh, enough time for to go up and um, have a look for, for some more. But um, when I went into um, the range where I was looking for the um, the wool, and that's what I got, the, um, the Payton's Fab double knit. I got six balls of the white, because if you get six balls, you, um, you get them for £10. Otherwise, a one ninety nine, one ninety nine a ball. If you buy a single ball, I probably only needed about five, but um, I bought the six anyway because I don't come in um, wrong. So I got six balls, balls of those. And while I was looking around, um, I do a, um, a bingo night with uh, some friends on a, um, a Wednesday, Wednesday night. And that's what I was looking for, bingo books. This keeps us, because we get our own bingo books and we do it all ourselves. We sort it out ourselves, me and the girls. So they were only a pound each, the, um, the books. So I bought four of them because we're always, always running out of them. And one or two other girls bring them in and they pay one ninety nine, but it's exactly the same books. So I thought I'm getting these ones from the, um, the range where they've got them in. This was all I had, these four. So I've got four different colours, grey, yellow, orange and brown. The only one they didn't have was a red one, but I got a red one the last time I was in, so that was okay. That keeps us going for our, um, for our bingo night. And then I also seen these, you know, the dabbers when you're doing your, um, your bingo. Mine, I think the one I've got is starting to, um, I think it's starting to run out, so I thought I'd better get myself another one. That was 79 pence, so that wasn't bad. And that was all I got in, um, oh no, I didn't. I got a, an 8mm pair of knitting needles. I think they're about the only size knitting needles I haven't got. No, I think I haven't got seven. I haven't got the seven millimetre as well. I was looking for the seven millimetre as well, but um, I bought these ones. Um, I bought two pound fifty for um, the eight millimetre in the um, the metal. No, they're not. They're plastic. Yes, plastic. I don't think they do metal ones in the larger in the larger ones. But I could have kicked myself because I went into uh, Poundland after the range and they weren't the same ones but they were the same size I had for a bloody pound. Like. <laughs> but <laughs> it always happens to me things like that but uh, anyway I've got them uh, now so I'm going to make do with them. And then I went into Poundland and I went into Poundland just looking to see if they had any um, of the blue wool or I, I couldn't get in the, um, the range but they didn't have any either but I saw these balls that um, it's like a mixture of lemon and white or what it's called um, gorgeous baby and they're, they're a pound each but if you buy three you get them for two pound so you get one ball free so I bought three balls and I thought I'm doing these for the little, the small little ones that I'm uh, building my uh, stock up for when I, I start my Etsy shop. And I thought I can get some little, maybe little 22, 20s or 22 inch little cardigans out of um, those ones. And then there was this colour here as well and this has got like a, um, 
It's a green, a blue, a lilac, a lemon, and I think there's white, white in it as well. It's like a mint, a mint green. It's a lovely one, that one. So I got three balls of those ones, and the same as the other ones. I wore a, um, a pound each, but three for the price of um, for two pound. So that was a good um, little bargain. It's uh, it's nice. I've had Poundland um, wool before, and it's quite um, nice in there. And then I'm just looking around this shop, and that's a dove. Dove deodorant, that's the original one, that was only a pound. Now I think I pay over two, over two pound for this in uh, most other um, shops and it's the only one I can use because I'm allergic to perfume. And any deodorant, most deodorants I try, they make me itch like something not right, but Dove's the only one that I can use, so that was quite good, that was only a pound. I also got some milk which I put in my fridge, was a pound each. For four paints. I got some uh, Seabrook crisps. These were a pound for a pack of uh, six. I like these ones. They're those wrinkled crisps with the sea, the sea salt on. They're, they're nice. I like these ones. So I got those. A pack of those for a pound. What else did I get? Uh, Oh, there's some. Just pack of pack of four notebooks. You know the reporters' notebooks. They were a pound for a pack of them, um, four, and they never come in wrong. I'm always using things like that. You know, for writing my list on when I go out shopping or just jotting anything down. They come in handy. Those. And then I bought was a pack of. I bought this for one needle that I want out of it. I cannot find a darning needle. That's when I come to sew, to sew up all my things. The darning needles I got are too thick and sometimes they'll hardly go through the um, the wool. And the other ones I've got, the smaller ones, the holes are too small for the um, to get the wool through. And this one I saw, it's got one needle in there that's a lot thinner than the ones I need and it's got a good size eye on it. And I think there's another smaller one down here with a, um, a big eye. So there's actually two needles in there that I would probably be um, using. That one there maybe as well. That's got a, um, a pointed edge, a shaped edge on the, um, the bottom bar, you know, going like that. don't know what you call them. It's probably got it on the back. A curved, the curved one for upholstery. And that was only a pound. They were a pound. And then I got these little little scissors. Um, I already have one pair like this, but I'm I'm always either putting it in either in my knitting bag or in a little little um, bag that I have that I have all my hoops and that in. And I'm having to keep looking for them when I want them. So I thought I want a pair that I can just put on my coffee table, just having my coffee table all the time. So I bought that, and that was only a pound as well. So well, that wasn't bad either. And I'm looking to see what else. And then I saw this at little hobby box. It's got a an opening at the um the top and it's got all little compartments in, smaller ones where I can put buttons and things like that in. And that's on one end. And the other end it's exactly the same. It's got two two compartments in where you can put the same things in. There. It's got the same little compartments inside and that. And that was only a pound as well. So I thought that's going to come in um, handy. Um, I like those sort of things. And it's got a little picture on the front to show you all the sort of things you can that come that'll come in handy for. But I think it'll be mostly um, buttons and uh, maybe odd little odds and ends for um, for me because I've got buttons all over the place. And that. Uh, 
this. That was it. That was my little shot and haul um, for today. It's just a little uh, mini one um, just to get what um, what I needed. So if you like my video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll let you see you the next time um, I'm out. Um, I'll be out again looking for more wool um, because I know I've got a quite, I'm getting quite a few orders to, um, to do. So I'm always looking for, um, for more wool for Usually the orders that come, I've got lots of wool, but most of the orders that come in is for wool I have, the colours I haven't got. But anyway, that's my bit for now, so bye, see you later.